Hi, my name's Alex and today I'll be taking you through this week's question and answer session from us here at Anova Systems. Thanks for watching. We've been asked several times, um, why has my assembly changed colour? If we look at the model here and drill down into any one of this, these sub-assemblies, you can see that various colours have been applied to the sub-assemblies which we're not seeing at the top level. Now if we right click on a component or an assembly within the, uh, the graphics area and have a look at the appearance drop down, it appears here that the only place that the appearance has been applied is, is to the part and it's a polycarbonate plastic appearance and we don't seem to be seeing it. So where is this grey appearance coming from? Well the likelihood is that the grey appearance has been applied to the top level assembly, particularly if it's all a single colour. Now to verify this what you want to do is just expand your display pane from the feature tree and that will show you here where the appearances have been applied to the models. So for instance what we have here is a single triangle where we can see those appearances. So nothing's overriding um, the, the, the part appearance there. Where it has been overridden is on the top level assembly. You can see that we have this color appearance applied to the top level assembly. And if we select that, you'll have the option here to remove the appearance. By doing this, it allows all the part appearances to propagate through into the top level assembly. And now the assembly is looking as we want it to look. That brings us to the end of the video. Thank you for watching.